everyone, it's Carrie Ann and I wanted to do a video today just to introduce you to us here at 30 Queen Street. Just in case you haven't managed to come and see us yet and then this will hopefully give you an idea of what sort of things you'll find. So the idea here is um, we have everything creative. So we are home to the hobby shop, which is the section just in the corner over here. That's one by Jonathan Betty. Um, so we just give him a space to run his hobby business and he has a wider range online as well. So that's um, signed memorabilia, Airfix kits, sort of um, like the Airfix Lego type construction quick build, I think it's called, um, like Meccano type things, all sorts of things hobby based. Um, that's all run by the hobby shop. The other thing we have here at 30 Queen Street is Devon Art Supplies. So Devon Art Supplies is um, an online and here in store. It's high-end art supplies and all the way from sort of the very basic to the student and then the high-end art supplies as well. So we have um, gouache, acrylic, watercolour, oil paints, all the mediums, the papers. If you can't see it in store, we have a, a really quick turnaround for catalogue orders. So we are happy to order things in for you and they're usually in next day, if not next day, within a couple of days for pretty much everything in stock. Um, I'm also an SAA member, so if you are an SAA member too, um, because I'm an associate, it means that we work together closely with them and we can get you the discount prices for SAA members. Um, it also means that we can get all the special SAA products as well. So we have started um, getting out all the Christmas stock. I know you Christmas crafters start early. So obviously you can see here, there's lots of bits and pieces. Um, we've got pretty much anything you could imagine creativity wise, kits and bits and bobs and all sorts. Um, so Devon Art Supplies moves on and we still have a little bit of what was Imagine Design Create, so that's the craft element, um, but our focus is obviously on bringing more of the arts in, um, but there is a good overlap. So you will th find things like inks and paints and adhesives and pens and glitters and lino cutting and punches and stencils and stamps. Because it all overlaps with the arts, um, we will still stock in bits and pieces of that. Now what you can see in the far corner is some of the sewing and embroidery. We may well um, stop doing that in the future, so what is there is, is the last of the stock for the moment. We will decide on that going forward, but at the moment we're pretty sure we won't be restocking that in, unless of course lots of you say, please keep going and we will decide what we can do. This is the children's corner, so there's lots of arty things for children. We do felt, we do foam, we do decker patch. Um, we've still got a really wide range of decker patch, even though the display is a smaller display. We still have what we have um, in terms of um, options, because obviously we brought this here five years ago now, so we had a really massive display of it then, but um, we've just cut the display down to fit lots of other things, really. So we have lots of children's things there and some of the special offer ones ready for Christmas are there as well. And then in the far corner, this is where it leads into Botanica Gallery. So Botanica Gallery is kind of a, what we call a step-up gallery for artists who haven't exhibited before in other galleries but want that opportunity to display their work and get it out there to the public. We've been very successful in sales of cards, prints, and also framed originals. So in just a few short months that we've been here, we've been really successful, so thank you all for your support. Um, there is a nice little seating area, so you can come and join us for a tea or a coffee and a chat. No charges for tea and coffee. If you're just coming in and having a chat with us about the arts, we welcome you for coming in for that. Um, obviously we've got lots of lovely artwork from lots of different local artists all over East Devon and then we do sell the cards as well so if you're looking for an original art card come on in and see us. Um, so it's all local artists. Um, we have lots of different handmade bits and pieces as well mostly focused on sort of natural so logs and bits and pieces like that and we have beading and embellishments. Um, we have a really wide range of wools and yarns now. Um, we've always done Starcraft. We used to just do the double knit and the chunky, but we now have Aran, we have Eskimo, we have cottons, we have all sorts of different patterns, glittery and all sorts. Uh, we do buttons and all sorts of other things. And then further out here is my sort of studio and garden. Um, so this is where I do teaching. So I do one-to-one -one teaching. I also do bits and pieces for anyone who wants to do nature crafts. We've got a lot of bits and pieces out here. Um, so obviously I, I teach out here and then we also do sort of groups and meetings as well. And then I have a little area where I do some teaching out here and run sessions and clubs. 
and we also sell um, houseplants. So a lot of these are propagated here. Um, I love to grow lots of different houseplants. So out in the studio now is mainly um, my teaching and sort of where I work as a, in my art projects as well. The garden is looking a little bit sorry for itself at the moment, purely because of the, all the rain we've had recently. So yeah, that's what you'll find if you come and visit us here at 30 Queen Street. Lots of things for anyone who's interested in creativity or anyone who's looking for, a, you know, something for someone creative over the festive period. We do have dyes and card making materials as well, stickers and stamps and all sorts really. And then finally is my Neil's Yard. So I'm a Neil's Yard rep and I keep on site a wide range of Neil's Yard products. Um, this is really just sort of my sideline of what I do. Um, so if you are looking for anything Neil's Yard, pop in and see me. I am a trained and insured holistic therapist. Obviously I don't get much time to practice because I'm always running the shop. Um, so if you do need any advice on any of the products, then just pop in and see me or send me an email and I'll do what I can to help. As you can see, all sorts of essential oils and things. And um, that overlaps as well with the creativity side because obviously you can use your essential oils when you're making things like little hanging cushions for friends and family or bath salts and things. So just have a chat with me if you've got any questions about any of that. So yes, that is 30 Queen Street. Thanks for taking the time to watch the video and I hope you will pop up and see us. Um, we're just at the top. I know it's a bit of a trek from the centre of town. I know a lot of you sort of didn't know we were already up here and things like that, but we have been here now for just over five years. Um, so we are loving it here in Seaton. It has been hard, I'm not going to fib. <laughs> it's been really hard to keep things going. As you can see, it's a very quiet part of the town. Um, but we want to stay here, so we hope you will continue to support us and help us to stay alive um, and enjoy the changes we've made to sort of focus ourselves on the arts and the gallery going forward. So. Thanks for watching and listening to me waffle on. I hope you all have a lovely week and weekend and I hope to see you soon. Bye bye.